It's not about motivation. Winners need discipline. Wake up and win today. Discipline comes from within. Boxing King Media in association with Box Draw. Matthew Hatton, Matt, uh, it's weighing day. A uh, bit of a spicy press conference yesterday. Uh, how do you think Campbell's kind of dealing with the whole occasion and the fact that he's got somebody who's got a fan base behind him and is, is coming here to basically, you know, uh, defend his title? Yeah, it's, um, you know, Campbell's had 14 fights now. This is fight number 15. So, ready to make our move forward now. And, uh, you know, the central area title. I'd like to see more area title fights, to be honest. You know, some of these belts these days, some of these baubles people are fighting for. I do like the area title fights, as you've seen yesterday. Local pride at stake. And uh, that brings the best out in the boxer. So, it's, uh, it's a good test for Campbell, a good step up. And, and we're looking forward to it. You know, I spoke to uh, Jimmy Joe the other day and I said to him, like, do you respect the fact that Campbell's willing to fight for an area title rather than, like, we've seen a lot of prospects fight for these WBA international belts and it seems like you could kind of select your opponent, fight whoever you want, and he's chosen to go down this route when he probably doesn't need to. Yeah, it's a good fight, you know, it's, um, you know, Jimmy's got the central area title fight, but Jimmy's the kind of opponent we, wa we want now to, to push on with his career and to move forward, so... I think it's a good fight for Campbell anyway, and it's a bonus that he's fighting for the Central Area title. You know, it's a, it's about his dad won, it's about I won, uh, and it'd be great for him to add, it, add his name to that list. Well, what's been the big difference in Campbell, the way he approaches things? Because I've noticed that his last three, four fights, the critics are starting to, be go, uh, starting to go silent. A lot of more people are praising his performances. He's had some good knockouts as well. So what, what was the change in kind of the shift from the guy that was getting criticised to now? People are saying, actually, you know, he's really good. Yeah, you know, um, he turned professional early, Campbell. And um, it was always going to take time. He, he was put in some, you know, uncomfortable positions that he shouldn't really have been put in, really. Um, you know, um, but he's getting better. He's improving. He's getting more experience. He's in, you know, he's, he's maturing as a boxer and, and as, a, as a man. So he's getting better and better and uh, I think that's going to continue. What, what did you make of what happened in the press conference yesterday? It looked really intense and they gave each other a bit of a stare down. And uh, are, you, are you wanting a fire fight? Because I get the feeling that's what Jimmy Joe wants. Yeah, you know, Campbell's a come forward aggressive yeah, yeah. fighter. So, uh, you know, Campbell won't be... Uh, changing his tactics uh, for Jimmy Joe Flint. Campbell's going to go in there and do his thing and do what he does. Um, I think it's going to be a great clash of styles. I hope Jimmy sticks to his words and comes to to uh, have a fight with Campbell. Whether he'll do that or not, I'm not too too sure. He had a lot for, to say for himself uh, yesterday. So let's see if he can back it up on Saturday. Uh, yourself and your brother had a big fan base. Has that kind of transition? Have they started following Campbell's journey as well? Yeah, you know, uh, Campbell got off to, to a fairly slow start, but people can see the, the improvement in Campbell now. You know, he's worked hard, he's working in the gym all the time and, and just trying to get better and he is getting better. So, uh, yeah, you know, people starting to get behind Campbell now and hopefully we'll see his fan base grow and grow. Final prediction? I think Campbell will, will, will win on Saturday. Uh, I think it's a good fight. I think it'll be an entertaining fight. But for me, Campbell's too much for him and... Uh, I've got no doubt Campbell beats him on Saturday. Matthew Hatton, just last one in the corner, is that Ricky going to be in the corner as well? No, Ricky manages Campbell, but he, he leaves it to me in the corner, so he'll be there on Saturday. He'll be there in, in the changing rooms. He's always on anti Campbell advice as well. Um, so he'll be in the changing rooms on Saturday, but not in the corner. So we'll look forward to seeing you guys in action. Thank you. Nice one, mate. i got a question for you. Where can discipline take you? Discipline points you towards your goals.